Hey guys, it's Rachel and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is extra exciting because this is going to be my closet and wardrobe tour. So I've been planning to do this video for quite a long time, but if you guys have been watching me as of lately, you'll know that I'm actually switching rooms in my house and I'm just changing things up a little bit and getting my room together. So my closet was definitely one of those projects that I wanted to finish right away. There will be a room tour coming up soon, but this one will just be my closet and wardrobe and show you guys how I organize things. Uh, so my mom actually helped me KonMari, um, my whole wardrobe slash my closet, as well as um, get everything a little bit more organized. I'm really happy with the way it turned out. As much as I wanted to be stylish and pretty, I also wanted to be very practical. So this is my system. I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'm just going to get right to it. So we're actually going to start with the closet and then I'm going to move on to the wardrobe after. But um, this whole closet system is, I think, from Canadian Tire. We got it a few years ago and I don't think they sell it anymore, but there are definitely different options at Ikea that you can look at. Um, this is just kind of what worked for this space. So I'm just going to start with just these small drawers here. Now this is just for my lightweight stuff. Um, the first drawer being my workout gear. So in here I have just like my shorts, my leggings, my sports bras, my tank tops, anything that I would need. Um, for the gym will be in here. So the next drawer is actually my favorite drawer and this is because it's my accessories drawer and I just really believe that like accessories totally give life to your entire outfit. So this holds all my belts, um, a few go-to pieces like my earrings, my braces, my watches, my sunglasses, like anything that I would go to every day to just dress up an outfit. Let me pull out a few favorite pieces just to show you guys because I think this is pretty cool. So first thing, this Gucci belt. This is actually my mom's but I wear it all the time. I find like it makes me really want to like invest in a really nice belt. Um, a really good piece to kind of dress up your outfit. Another thing I have in here is my favorite baseball cap. This is when I went to New York City for the first time. Um, I went with my boyfriend Dylan and it was really fun and it's just a little souvenir to like commemorate the trip but I found myself wearing this all the time and I love it. So I'm sure you'll see this a lot better in the cutaways but this is my bikini drawer. Again KonMari folded and they're not folded by like tops and bottoms but rather actually like sets and that is because I don't like to mix and match my bikinis and if you guys have watched my videos you'll know that. Um, I really like my bikinis to match so there are barely any like loose random like rogue bottoms in here or whatever but yeah this is just how I like to organize them. They're not color coded anything. I just want them to be like neat and they are when I need them. Moving on to my last drawer. This is non-clothing related but it is my camera equipment drawer. Um, my mom is like a labeling expert I guess and she has labeled every single thing in here so I know exactly what everything is. My hard drives, my headphones, just anything tech related is in this bottom drawer and yeah. So this is the current shoe situation. I actually have a lot more shoes than this. These are just the ones that I kind of wanted on display and whatnot and the ones that I tend to reach for are these two rows here as well as some of my boots. I have some heels on display just because they're really pretty and I think they're definitely um, something that you should have on display because they're gorgeous. I have like a love of sneakers and because I wear so much black and gray, I find that the way I tend to add color is by adding sneakers. I am not a sneakerhead by any means, but I definitely appreciate a really good Nike and this is one of my favorite ones right now. Um, this I actually got at the Von Mills outlet. They were $30 and I think they look really cool. They remind me of like the Supreme Louis Vuitton collab that's going on right now. I'll show off my Hirachis. I just love these shoes. I think they're really, really pretty and I just love the deep red. They just make them look so luxe. One thing I actually recently did was add these little wings to my Stan Smith sneakers. And you know that I wear these a lot in um, my like how I style videos and stuff like that. But I thought that the like wings and stuff made it look really really cute and special so that is something that I added and makes them look a little bit more unique because you know everyone has these these days. Um, down here I also have some of my black like basic booties and stuff like that as well as my Tims um, and then some heels and stuff like that. Um, so here is actually all of my hanging stuff and this is where I keep a lot of my sweaters. They are very very near and dear to my closet. 
I just love them. Here I just kind of organize them by like turtleneck style, then like crew neck style, then like sweaters, and then hoodies and stuff like that. There's um, there's no real color coding in this process. I just want to separate them by type. Um, and these are the ones that I kind of go to in the morning uh, when I'm getting dressed. And then on this side, I have more sweaters. Um, I have a few skirts and a few dresses that I showed in my last haul um, that I have yet to put away, but I also have just some open cardigans, some sweater dresses, and then a few of my bomber jackets. A favorite one that I have right now is this. Um, this is from Shein, and I just love the embroidery on the back. I think it's really fun, and I'm really excited to wear this in the springtime with these because I just think that's going to look really dope. So another one of my favorite pieces in my closet is definitely this jacket. So this is like a vintage guest jacket and I think this is also really cool. I picked this up from Salvation Army and it's just really oversized and something that is so like in right now. And then you can't go wrong with a basic crew neck. So I have one of these, these are just like plain gilding crew necks. Um, this one is in a nude color and these are definitely my go-to for like any sort of lazy day or like bachelor night or anything like that. So you gotta have some crew necks on hand for, you know, those lazier days where you just wanna stay in. And I'll show this a lot better in the cutaways, but this is basically where I keep any of my bags. Um, I stuff my bags with other bags. I don't really have like a massive bag collection. I only have like a few bags that I really love and I keep. So up here is that stuff, my weekend bag, my gym bag, my boxing gloves, um, just stuff like that just stays up here and is just really easy to reach and grab and go when I need to pack up or travel or whatever I need to do. So we are gonna move on to my closet now. So I have a few frames here that I'm just waiting for a few prints to come in. But this is kind of where I keep my bag. Um, this is a mom dresser. Um, I have one of these also in my old room. It's really easy, look really clean, and I think look a lot more um, luxe than they are. So this is the bag that I normally carry. I usually just sit it up here. It's my Z Deegan Voltaire bag. So we are going to go through the drawers now. So I figured it'd be fun to go through these drawers just like this, and I'll show you guys some zoom-ins and the cutaways, but so this is the first drawer I'm going to show you guys. It is my loungewear drawer. Um, I pretty much have all my pajamas in here. As you guys know, I really like matching sets, so um, quite a few of these are just matching pajamas. Uh, I also have my socks in here um, from long socks, thick socks, ankle socks. Those who know me really well know that I really like wearing socks to bed, so it kind of makes sense to have these two things together. Um, this is my pants drawer. It looks like I have absolutely no pants, but I actually just went away for the weekend to Montreal, so a few of them still have to go into laundry and stuff, but I just store like my jeans here, my leather leggings, like anything um, bottom related. These are some of my dresses that are foldable and don't really fit in my closet right now. It's winter currently, so these don't really need to be on rotation or anything, so I just have them stuffed at this bottom drawer. Moving on. And then this drawer is like my underwear and stuff. I figured it'd be weird to show that, but it's all up there with my bras and everything. Um, the next drawer here is some of my t-shirts and tops. Again, this looks quite empty, but I just recently did like a huge purge of my clothes. And then the next thing I have here on the bottom. Um, this drawer looks really empty right now, uh, but it is just a bunch of my jean shorts as well as a few of my leggings. Um, I have a feeling this drawer will get a little bit fuller in the summer, but currently this is pretty much it. So that actually concludes my whole closet tour. Thumbs up this video if you like this and want to see a room tour coming up quite soon. Also, if you guys want to keep up with me, I am posting on my blog a little bit more regularly as well as on my Instagram, so definitely follow me there if you guys want to check that out. And without further ado, I am going to go, but I hope you guys have an amazing day, and thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.